Look at this air conditioner. How there's water around the bottom of it. All the way around. It should be leaving out the drain pipe. And you say, well, why isn't it leaving out the drain? We'll see if the camera can pick it up. It's hard out here in the sun. I don't know if you can see. You hear that slurping sound? If there's no trap. If there's no trap. The very bottom of this pipe is water leaving, but the top of it is air being sucked back in and it's blowing the water into the system. And you're gonna get that and you're gonna get leaks in your roof and you're gonna get mold in your ducts. There has to be a trap on every air conditioner. No trap, no trap. Outstanding, I can show you what I mean about the trap. So this is a trap. So water has filled the entire base and then it trickles out and this is not sucking any air in. And you'll notice this is the only air conditioner that is dry all the way around the bottom. There's no water pooling. There's no water getting places it shouldn't go. So that's what I mean by there needs to be a trap on every unit. Look at the water pouring out of this unit when I took the cover off. It's pouring out of the unit because there's no trap. So the moisture's getting slung up here. What is that really gonna cost you? It's gonna cost you the unit. This is gonna rust out and you're gonna have to replace this entire unit long before it needs to be. It should be because they didn't put a piece wrap on the drain. No surprise, there's no mold everywhere. You're going to be mold into the ducts. And ultimately, you're going to fill the box downstairs, the duct box, and then it's going to start leaking in the ceiling. I haven't asked or really walked around inside. But I guarantee you, there's ceiling leaks near these units. And uh, by the way, the reason I opened it is, uh, yeah, backwards. Airflow. Behind door number two. Airflow. And these are gross. So there's no flipping these around. I'm not sending that into the system. 